Man, a 90 second round with a two minute grace compared to a three minute 330. First, that make it exclusive. It's for members only, you're probably not included. First watch finders, I only hang with shooters. If I pop out with this cannon, then we gon' make a new year. I come through a gang on them and bang on them. Hanging out the window and put that flame on them. Anybody get these bullets, ain't got names on them. Would you like to subscribe, then hit the play button. Yeah. Yo, 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 Wes, Wes, Wes. Hey, and then though we are back, baby. It is first watch finding. Shout out my subscribers. Everybody rocking with they boy. Do me a favor though. Like, comment, share, subscribe to the channel. You heard me? Y'all know over here we don't jersey, but I tell you what they were trying to do. They were trying to make Rum Nitty Jersey. What? Hold up, man. Hey, I know y'all probably heard about it, but just in case. Rum Nitty Battle Foots this weekend on the uh, Civil War card. And um, after the battle, a lot of the consensus, people's coming out of there saying Foots 30. Foots won every round. Foots 30. Of course, us Rum Nitty fans, the aliens, you know what I'm saying? We like 30? No way, dog. We don't, there ain't no way. No way. I got to see this. You know what I'm saying? But apparently, uh, the contracts. So Rum Nitty puts out a, a a little piece of his contract, you know what I'm saying, online saying I was only told 90 seconds, two minute round, two minute grace. And his opponent had three minutes, 30 seconds. Wait, 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 wait. 90 second rounds, two minute cutoff versus three minutes and 30 seconds. That can't be legal. Anybody that got a minute and 30 seconds more of rap than the next man, you got, you go, I mean, you supposed to win that battle if you doing what you're supposed to do. You know what I'm saying? Like an extra whole minute can make you like, if you're going back and forth and watching the battle, going bar for bar, breaking it down and who you got winning each round, an extra whole minute and 30 seconds can change everything. Have you looking at the battle a total different way because the other person rap longer. When that person raps longer and is hitting, you kind of going to lean with that person because it seems like he had more, he more prepared. He, you know what I'm saying, he wrote more about more bars. He's going to be more memorable because you see, you heard more of him more long lasting. you like, damn, I heard, I can't, that last minute and 30 that he wrote, damn, it's still right here. Over... The only two minutes that the other opponent got to rap. You know what I'm saying? So it's kind of like you're going to remember that one third, that last minute and 30 seconds is, is going to be more stuck in your brain than the two minute round, unless it's like super impactful two minute round. Now, I know Rum Nitty's been battling like, you know what I'm saying, like damn near every month. He's had a lot of battles. A lot of people say he needs to slow down. He's doing a lot. Is Rum Nitty getting watered down? I don't think he's getting watered down because his material is still A1, you know what I'm saying? Like, his material is still fire. It's just that they're hearing it so much and seeing him so much that it starts to get, you know, kind of like just, I don't know, people start to look at it different or they kind of like feel the same. I don't know, man. It's just when you start battling and doing something a little bit too much, it becomes like, you know, kind of repetitive and people expect a whole lot more from you. Or they just kind of like get used to seeing it and it's not the same. Rum Nitty's punches and setups have been out of this world at all times, all throughout this year, last I don't know how many years. His pen is up to par with the best of them, you know what I'm saying? But, you know, Lux had that thing, uh, man, Rum Nitty battling too much with you, woo and Everybody talking about he was battling foots, he battling foots, what the hell going on? We talking about Lux, he battling foots, and then this happens, you know what I'm saying? So, that sucks for the battle, but I don't think... I don't think Lux should not want to battle Nitty no more. I think they still need to run that. And Lux, try to get him right now while you think he's down or you think he's watered down. Try to take him right now if you think, you know what I'm saying? Like, you think you can beat him, take him right now. Lux, don't run now. Don't try to give it a reason to run he's battling. Take him now, Lux. But anyway, you know what I'm saying? Uh, my bad. I, I flipped out for a minute. But, yeah, so the thing going around is uh, Rum Nitty, they saying he got 30 by Foots. But Foots had a minute and 30 extra to rap. And I feel like usually when somebody has that much more to rap, 
and they're kind of prepared and you're battling somebody like Rum Nitty, you're supposed to write a little over and go in, but not if the opponent doesn't know that he has this much time to rap. Because if that's the fa fact, Rum Nitty supposed to be able to rap that long too to make sure nothing, you know, it don't look crazy at the end of his battle. Because just that quick, 30? Foots got a 30 on Rum Nitty? Like, I know Foots is good and all that, but a 30 is like, hold up. I really want to see that battle now. I really, really do. But shout out to Foots because he did come out online and say that uh, he tagged URL TV. It was like, hey, man, I want to I wanna redo that battle. Can we run that back? I don't want my win like this. Salute to Foots for that. That's gangster. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't want my win like this. I want my win the right way. I don't want nobody talking about it like this. So I feel that. There ain't nothing wrong with that. And I think Foots took the right approach. We'll see if they run it back and let them run it back. You know what I'm saying? I don't know if that's going to be a thing or not. But um, I know that's like kind of like a, a little bit of a black eye for Rum Nitty, who's been on the run this year. You know what I'm saying? And uh, some people got him losing to Ilmac. I didn't. I don't know how y'all got. Some people got him losing to Jazz. I didn't have him losing that battle either. And I didn't see this battle. So, you know what I'm saying? I don't really have him losing like that too many battles this year. Do I have him even losing this year? I don't think I ain't think I got him losing this year. But they got him losing a few of them battles. And then on top of that, this battle right here, just not a good look for Run, who's been putting in work and didn't deserve, you know what I mean, to be lined up like that. Now, but look, the contract-wise, if you – how do you send out two different contracts? How do you send out two different time limits? That don't make no sense. One person got one time, none got the other. How does that even happen? Unless you're trying to do it. Was that an error? Was that a, a contract error? This a, a typo? Because how, how do you go from two minutes, 90 second, two minute cutoff to three minutes, 30 second cutoff? I don't see how that, how the contract goes down. They both got different time limits. So it would seem like somebody was trying to help Foots out, line Rum Nitty up. Make the battle more competitive. I don't know. But it ain't making no sense for that to go out like that. So for a contract to be that off on the time limits, it just seems kind of weird because you don't make those kind of mistakes on time limits. Though. I don't know. I mean, I know mistakes could happen, but on a contract, I don't know. Dog. No, hell no. They were trying to line rum near the air. They were trying to set my dog up, dog. They were trying to set him up. I know uh, they say P booked the whole Civil War card, what I was told. Just what I was told. Not saying it's official. But P booked the whole Civil War card. So did P put those contracts together? Did P try to set up Foots, help his DMV partner out? Or his, you know, where Foots from? New York? P tried to help out his motherfucking artist. P, you trying to set Nitty up to help out your artist, Nick? P, Nick. Nah, I know you ain't did that. P, I know you. You must have had your assistant write them contracts up and she made a mistake, huh? Because you didn't do that on purpose, did you, P? Did you, P? God damn it. I hope not, dog. Because this is like a black eye on Rum Nitty this year, man. This kind of puts like a, you know, like to the greatness he's brung to us this year. This kind of like puts a, like, a little bit of a black eye on it. You know what I'm saying? Like, this kind of sucks. You know what I'm saying? I don't like the fact that that happened to Rum. But um, if they do get to run it back, I'm pretty sure it'd be taking a different kind of context, but I don't really like the fact that they're having to run, man. That's not, that's kind of foul. You know what I'm saying? Cause he been doing this shit this year and I don't know, man, maybe we need to, uh, reevaluate some things on how we approach and run nitty battles and stuff. Cause the way rum, the rum he's, he's not, everybody's looking at him different now. They looking at him like he's seeing him too much. And if y'all looking at his content and his bars, he's not watered down at all at, at not a bit. He's not. Y'all just seeing him so much. Y'all so used to this shit that y'all just, y'all don't even know how to react to it no more. But really, he's been on fire and doing his shit all year long. He had his best, he said he had his best material versus Jazz. You get what I'm saying? That was just two battles ago. So, I don't know, man. It's kind of whack the fact that, you know what I'm saying, we got to sit here and talk about some shit like this. But, um, how y'all feel in the comments? Y'all think it was a lineup? Did they set Rum Nitty up? Is this a mistake that can happen or is this some bullshit? Because I don't know if this is a mistake that can happen. Like, just, just, I don't know. It's a hell of a mistake to happen, dog. It's a hell of a mistake. You know what I mean? But let me know how y'all feel in the comments about that. Because I was just like, huh? 
Nah, we ain't doing that. You know what I'm saying? We ain't doing that. To, not to rum. Rum and, uh, no, nah, we not doing that. No, no, no. 30? No, no, no. Something ain't right. And then when we said something ain't right, rum drops the contract. That's how we knew something wasn't right. The hell going on? Trying to line my guy up. But uh, shout out to Foots, though, because no slack to Foots. He did what he was supposed to do, handle his business. You know what I'm saying? And, and he apparently had fire material from what I'm getting. And you know what I mean? Like, he did what he he did his job. So that's fire. Salute to Foots for that. And I hate your W had to come, you know what I mean, for some shit like this and kind of mess up the rhythm and the, you know, the flow of it and the, you know what I mean, how you can capitalize off of Rum Nitty W. Because when you when you be somebody like Rum Nitty, it's just like, damn, you know what I'm saying? Like it don't happen often. Especially a 30. So shout out to Foots for doing what he's supposed to do, getting it done, and for being a stand-up guy and saying, hey, can we run that back? I don't want my win like this. That's a big salute, Foots. And uh, hopefully we get Rum Nitty to, uh, you know, either get this ram back or it's going to be a stain on him. I don't like the way it's going to be a stain on him in his champion of the year run and everything, his back-to-back -back run. But, you know, we got a lot of people going after that Cody right now, man. So we're going to do another talk about Cody later on. I got to talk about Cody. But uh, shout out to everybody rocking with their boy, though, man. I just wanted to tap in with y'all, see how y'all felt about that. You know what I'm saying? And uh, let me know how y'all feel about it in the comments. Uh, West West Wednesdays will be going down today. It will be going down today, y'all. Got a few people pulling up for a face-off for the card this weekend. Outside and upstairs. Uh, CRC Battle League with G. Will and Fate is the headline. I don't know if G. Will and Fate gonna pull up today because we got a few people ain't gonna make it, but I will say that will be some face-offs today. At least one or two. And uh, I'll tap in with y'all about that. If not, we gonna talk today. If not, we're gonna talk today. You get what I'm saying? So shout out to everybody rocking with that boy, man. Do me a favor, like, comment, share, subscribe to the channel. You heard me. Hey, Chef Trez ain't really lost this year. He ain't gonna check. Boy, smack, man. Shout out to First Watch Finest. Y'all already know what we do. You know what I'm saying? We bring y'all the exclusive motherfucking content when it comes down to this battle shit. Nigga. You know what I'm saying? Y'all already know how we give it up, man. I got smack.